Hello Taurus, how are you? Welcome to my channel, Star 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 and welcome to your reading. So Taurus, this is your reading for the month of August 2021 and this is a general reading. Take what resonates and leave what doesn't. Energies might be vice versa and time is fluid, okay? Also Taurus, I would appreciate if you would hit like, share and subscribe and comment down below if you find yourself getting resonated with this reading. Taurus, I would also request you to hit that notification bell so that you will be notified whenever I upload the videos. There is uh, the link for the forecast for the next five months have been uploaded. Uh, I've analyzed your love life, your your career, your money, your uh, your life in general uh, for the next five months, starting from August till the end of December 2021. I have also advised, uh, provided some spiritual advice. Okay, if you're interested, the link is provided in description box and also in the comments section. Okay, all right, so. Now, coming back to this reading, Taurus, what I'm going to do is I'm going to place a couple of cards on the left and they will represent your past energy. Then I'm going to place a couple of cards uh, in the center and they will represent your present energy. I'm going to place a couple of cards on the right and they will represent your uh, they will represent your future energy. OK, so Taurus, let's get started now. Let's get started. We have a queen, then we have queen of pentacles, eight of pentacles and the fool. Then we have as four of cups, the temperance and we have as three of cups, the sun, then two of pentacles and king of cups. So Taurus, you may be dealing with an Aries, a Sagittarius, Leo. Okay, so Aries, Leo, Sag. Okay, all the, we have major arcanas for all fire signs, huh? Aries, Leo and Sagittarius. Uh, you may be dealing with uh, Pisces, Cancer, Scorpio, Taurus, Virgo, Capricorn. If the sign pops up, all the better. Let's not remain fixed on the signs. So we have Queen of Pentacles, Eight of Pentacles and the Fool for the past. Hmm. Someone was focusing on building themselves up or building up their finances. There is an energy where someone was discontent about their existing spiritual growth or existing uh, overall growth or existing growth in their finances. Okay, so the focus was building up, building themselves up, building up uh, their personality, uh, building up their money. Okay, there is there was definitely an, an energy of discontentment. Okay. Maybe your person was busy building up their money. Maybe you were focusing on your career. Okay. I also see that there was a strong energy to take a leap of faith towards someone. This person, uh, your past person, Taurus. Okay. They initially their focus was someone something else or someone else, okay. But maybe uh, over a over the course of period of time, this person had realizations and they were like, "Let me take a leap of faith towards Taurus and let's see what happens." Like I'm ready to face the consequences. That that sort of energy I'm getting over here, okay. So there was a strong urge to take a leap of faith towards you, okay. Mm. all right so let's see what is the present energy we have is four of cups temperance and three of cups so maybe your past person they wanted to take a leap of faith towards you but they were afraid of your re uh, reaction afraid of re uh, rejection there was some sort of a fear they they wanted to take a leap of faith towards you but then they kept on holding themselves back because they know, they are very well aware that they disappointed you in a big way, okay? They showed you the dreams which they couldn't fulfill in the past. And they they are thinking, like, why were they acting in such a manner? What sort of drove them to, uh, what sort of triggered them to behave like this with you? They always keep on wondering, 
why did i behave like this when they knew that taurus was such a nice and a loving and a caring person so nice and kind right so they are wondering about their own behavior right now i'm also sensing taurus some opportunities are coming your way and these opportunities are related to your love life only okay so either it's an opportunity where opportunity to make things right between you and your person or opportunity to stabilize your love life we have temperance so there is an opportunity to make things right either make things right between you and your person or make things right about your love life okay and if this is you taurus if this is your energy in four of cups okay if you're feeling very sad uh, if you're feeling not so happy about your love life if you're feeling that your love life is not heading in the right direction or there is absolute stagnancy in your love life then don't worry there is always light at the end of the tunnel okay if things are getting delayed in your life i'm getting a message that soon you're going to hear something or soon something will happen in your life which will make you happy all over again which will relieve which will relieve you from a lot of stress that you're carrying around your love life okay there will be events of celebration there will be moments of victory there will be a sense of achievement you'll be like finally there there is going to be a big relief that's what i'm getting with that temperance and with that 3 of cups because i see that you are in this energy right now taurus you are feeling sad you are feeling demotivated about your love life you're not so happy about your love life there is a feeling that ah uh, i don't think so i'm not i'm happy with my love life i'm not happy with the way it's progressing in fact i see that there is no progress nothing is happening i'm meeting wrong people i am wasting my time over wrong people and then things go back to uh, back to square one none of the relationships have worked out and why something like this is happening maybe you also need to do some self analysis if you are entertaining similar kind of people in your life if there is a pattern in your uh, uh if there is a pattern in your romantic life then you need to do that you need to do some you need to know that you need to do some shadow work okay so with the 3 of cups you are going to hear some good news uh regarding your love life maybe a new person will enter in your life or things will start looking better okay something is going to happen which will sort of uh relieve you from from the burden you are carrying like burden of overthinking or you know because you are feeling bit negative about your love life that news or that information or that event will sort of uh, relieve you taurus we have a uh, sun then two of pentacles and king of cups for the future okay again an energy where you're feeling very happy you are going to uh, you're going to feel very happy with the way your love life unfolds okay you're feeling that your love life is a sort of um, mystery every single day there are new surprises every single day is different and every single day is very positive every single day you get to know something more in your love life or about a new person who has entered in your uh, in your life okay and it's a positively it's a pleasant surprise okay it bring it is bringing more and more uh, positivity in your life and you are happy with the way it is progressing okay so yes there is a probability that you will meet a new person some of you may reconnect with the past person let's not deny that okay but there is a strong energy where you're going to feel very happy regarding your love life so expect something happening okay there is going to be a lot of there is going to be a lot of action one thing is for sure taurus that you are going to be in a relationship where there will be no burdens at all i don't see your person keeping any sort of expectations or high expectations from you except the reasonable ones okay 
this person is not at all going to be controlling this person is this person believes in something that you every single person needs their space every single person needs that required freedom okay uh, where which will make which will make everyone happy like they don't believe in controlling and suppressing and enforcing their will on someone okay and you are definitely someone who loves liberation and you are someone who loves their own freedom you don't like relationships and situations where you are feeling that your freedom is getting curbed okay and there is also an innocent happiness in this relationship there is going to be fun and laughter and uh, the situation will look very positive to begin with the two of pentacles yes your past person may pop up in your life while you are with a new person okay they may be like they even if they come towards you they will struggle to express whatever they are feeling okay they will come towards you just because they are having a lot of fear to lose you okay and winning you back is going to be a struggle for them it's not going to be easy for them or you are not going to make it easy for them okay or they will see you with someone else and they will just lose their confidence to say whatever they want to say they will go through a lot of emotional turbulence if they get to know that you are with someone this person will experience tremendous amount of pain and emotional turbulence inside them okay they may become obsessed and possessive about you this person i'm getting a feeling that this person will keep on popping up in your life i don't know why they feel that, that there is an unfinished business between you and them they have this feeling that there is an unfinished business for you and them and they will keep on working on themselves and they'll keep on waiting for you i'm feeling that someone is someone is a bit obsessed about you okay someone past person is obsessed about you this person will keep on popping up in your life taurus intermittently and then they will be like are you ready to be with me now every time they'll pop up in your life every time they are going to be like are you ready to be with me now i'm here i'm ready to offer my cup of love to you so i'm sorry but i'm getting a feeling of a psychopath over here okay it's not applicable for all but for few of you yes someone is a psychopath and they are obsessed and possessed about you i mean they are very possessive about you they just want you at any damn cost okay i i if if this is a case of a psychopath i just want you to be careful okay if this resonates hit like share and subscribe and comment down below till then bye bye if if you are interested you can check out the link for a 5 months forecast it is the link is in description box and also in the comment section i have analyzed your love life your your money your career your uh, life in general also provided some spiritual advice for you guys okay bye bye then